So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick out a few athletes for you to follow in Tokyo that I think could um, really outperform expectations. So the first athlete I'm going to pick is Keely Hodgkinson um, and she is a really exciting athlete um, who competes in the 800 meters. She's only 19 years old but has run incredibly well this year uh, and she's shown in her races that she's got really um, excellent tactical awareness. Keely goes into Tokyo ranked in 8th position because she's such a mature runner she's going to put herself in the best position to perform um, really really well and I think this is such a great opportunity for Keely to get some experience. Watch out for Mondo de Plantis. Mondo is a male pole vaulter from Sweden who is also the current world record holder. So in 2020 he cleared a height of 6 meters and 18 centimeters, uh, which is the current world record. Uh, he's already jumped 6 meters and 10 centimeters this year so he's in great form. So I fully expect him to come away from Tokyo with the gold medal. It's just whether he goes on to break uh, an attempt and break his own world record in Tokyo. Um, so keep an eye out for that. My next athlete to watch is Johannes Vetter, who is a German javelin thrower. Johannes finished fourth in Rio, um, but again he'll be looking to come away from Tokyo with a gold medal as he's already thrown 96 metres this year, which is quite a bit further than many of his competitors. Um, and just like Mondo, keep an eye out for this event because there's a potential world record. The world record stands at 98 metres and 48 centimetres, which is set by Jan Zalesny. So Johannes is not too far away from this on his season's best, so the world record could also be on his radar. Um, the final event um, to watch out for is the women's 400 metres because I think this is going to be a really exciting event. Uh, we've got Shawnee Miller Weibo from the Bahamas who is an amazing athlete and she's actually doubling up and competing in the 200 metres and the 400 metres in Tokyo but I'm tipping her to win the 400 metres in Tokyo. Um, also in the 400 metres is Alison Felix from the USA. Uh, Alison has won nine medals across four Olympics and if she picks up her 10th medal in Tokyo, she will have won more medals than any other female athlete, uh, female track and field athlete ever.